What's happening? You join us on a rainy Friday. We're doing a job that I've been, put, not putting off, a job that I've been trying to sort out a while. So we're doing the gearbox. Obviously, some of you may be aware. I'm sure I've mentioned it in a video. If not, quick recap. I bought this just over a year ago now from our friend Lucas. Good car, good color, decent price because I knew about an issue. When the, when the gearbox is warm, lurches slightly at first. So obviously Tom deals with a lot of these cars, said it could be clutch packs, could be mech. So we have taken it upon ourselves to buy a new gearbox, slap some bits on to upgrade it while we're doing it. Not the ideal day for it. Tom has had some stress. I'm just off the back of a big night shift, so I'm absolutely shattered. Thankfully, I want to say a big thank you before we get into the video to Forge Motorsport. Forge Motorsport have kindly decided to work with us. So it's a big thing for us. Obviously Tom fits a lot of Forge parts. So we have experience with them. They're a fantastic brand. They offer some unreal parts, one of the best in the world. And luckily we have been chosen to work with them. So that means for you lovely lot at home, you've got a discount code to use. If you want to order any parts, you can use NOMESSING10 at checkout and save yourself some dough. I have ordered some bits. Bum. Bash. So obviously while we're doing all this, thought we'd do a coolant kit. It's not all I've ordered. And obviously if you know anything about Mark V, some of the coolant pipes are plastic. And obviously 15 year old cars are going to be a bit brittle, they're going to snap. So I've ordered some aluminium bit. Hopefully future proof them. So to hopefully slightly future proof it, I've ordered a billet aluminium oil filter housing. It's got fins in, so pretty cool i don't know why i said that a larger oil cooler so hopefully that works i've also ordered a subframe dead set kit because we're dropping the subframe while we're doing it so we might as well do that i managed to source a box from danny at wigan bag parts if you watch any of evil gt you know they work quite close with him tom's on him all the time tom's bought some bits off him for various cars customers and that so we knew he's trustworthy he had a shirocco r come in if you follow him a white Scirocco R, about 80,000 miles, unfortunately been rear-ended. I bought the gearbox, so I got a decent price, and that's going to be going in. So less miles, newer, newer box, hopefully, fingers crossed we're laughing. But Tom has just given me some bad news, so I'm slightly heartbroken. My turbo is leaking oil. I think it's going to have to be KO4 time. I've got a KO4 at home, but there's some more bits I need. Hello. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom to you all. Oh. I'm a bit quiet. Got Will's worst toothache possible. And it's not in one of my teeth from Turkey. It's in my back tooth, my back wisdom tooth. So. It's not good in it, I think. I'm on opiates amount, so opiates. I'm on, that's how, I'm on that's how bad of an illness <laughs> I've got. I'm on copious amounts of paracetamol, cocodamol, tramadol, any sort of doll. Methadrone. Any sort of alcoholic beverage recently would yeah. be good out of treat some wkd some wickeds today we're going to be sorting the gearbox and hopefully we'll be driving lovely because i've got a nice video that i want to film let me go pros fucked i went to turn it on another day and it's brown bread if you look just in there you might just be able to see if it focuses it's tad bit wet oh we also found out that these have like where they've made the exhaust obviously this was this the car come with it it's like snapped a bit. this is the dead set kit we're going to be uh Apply in while it's on. Oh, pump it up. One fucked box out. didn't even need me here. So we're just testing the flywheel because the gearbox that I bought didn't come with a flywheel. The one that was on it, he said it weren't that great. So we're just testing mine. So see, if we don't need a flywheel, it saves us like 600 quid, isn't it? Yeah. It's not a cheap thing. So if it's good enough, we're gonna, use, we're gonna reuse mine. I'm gonna say that, sorry. Well, that's success. Sometimes maybe good. Sometimes maybe shit. I just want to give you all a better look at the sexiness from Jack's body. Forge. I went for black because much like Tom, that's the fantasy. Jubilee clips, obviously lovely, jubilee. Nice packaging to be fair. Normally it just comes in like 
miscellaneous brown boxes. So use that code. And if you are also wanting a set of these silicon hoses for your Mark 5 Golf GTI or Scirocco R or S3, this is the part number. I was gonna slide in, but I might hurt myself. It's FMK C010 hyphen BLA. Obviously, one of the good things about not only mine and Tom's civil partnership, but our partnership with... <laughs> yeah, obviously Tom can offer these fitted. So this is the benefit of Forge and no messing working together. But obviously anything you want fitting from Forge, Tom has the facilities to fit them. Obviously you've seen us time lap the majority of the actual hoses. We're just putting the last one on now. Like the ball ache one. It goes right under where the throttle body is. New box, old one. We've had a bit of food as well, Costco pizza. Tom's happy now, he's been fed. Don't worry. Kitty don't bite. Not now she's been fed. What the fuck was that? Fucking sliced himself earlier. Don't put your fingers anywhere, you'll put your cock. I'll put my fingers where I want in the cock. Oh, 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 oh. Look at me now, dirty. Every day, aren't they? Just a bit. Every day for you one time. You're gonna do fucking waste today. We are semi back together. It's been a been a long day. So we're just chucking the dead setting kit in now. We couldn't find out how to do it. So obviously what I showed you, you had a gold one and a copper one. I'll try and get the gold one out and show you. If you're ordering this from custom bag parts, you get a copper one like my colour to make my head, you get a gold one. Gold on top, copper on bottom. Jobs of fish. Speed. So we are currently in the air and it's actually on. So everything's working for now. We're just gonna test it. We need to scan it. So that is it. We've just took it for a test drive and tested it in drive. Manual sport, and it was alright on it. I didn't drive the car. Over I there. drove it. We survived. We survived. It felt how a box should feel. Like the one before, it was okay, but now driving that, like I said to Tom in the car, on the other one, it were quite snappy on upshifts, but going down, it really smooth. This is now the other way round. Coming down the gears, even in just normal drive, it's a bit snappier where you need it to be. But coming up, if your foot's like at a reasonable pressure point. Like it's dead smooth, but then like you put 50% on and it gets a bit snappier and then like we floored it and it definitely felt quicker. Obviously you've, you've been out in my car a lot, haven't you? Yeah, it feels a lot more smooth, it's a lot more direct, it's a lot more engaged, it does job and it's like it should be. But obviously this is, I've had, I've had this problem for a year, so I'm glad we finally got it done. Obviously it's a shame about the turbo now, but obviously it's just <laughs> one of them, like, you can't help it, can you? It's just so, your luck, innit? It's just my luck, yeah. Just wanted to, I just want to say another thank you to Tom. So, Sort him always helping me out obviously sort him, sort him out last minute actually we had quite a bit of notice for this i give him like two weeks notice for a job which is good for me but obviously i've been <laughs> buying i've been buying loads of parts tom's been telling me the best things to do and um, obviously a new turbo beam one yeah well that's i've got a turbo at home and i've got care for it home, but more on that later obviously we've got the lovely bartek filter housing the new 13 row cooler the lovely forge piping so obviously again a big thank you to forge and please remember to use our code.
it would mean a lot to me. What's that called, Zach? No missing 10. <laughs> Even if I'm in I remember our birthday. Oh, fuck like, God, don't can't, pull this one on. I can't remember to answer my text messages, but you can remember the code. That's yeah, no missing 10, guys. I just want to thank you all for watching. This is like the first decent sized job on this car. Obviously, there's going to be more to come. Obviously, we don't leave We don't leave things alone, do we? That's it's not, like, it's not, not in our nature. I'd like, I'd like to think this is just a testament to how Tom works and how, how we build cars. Rapid. We've not cut any corners with this. The better parts where I can, where I can help it. It's been a pleasure. Again, thank you, Tom. Thank you, Forge. It's been, it's been a long day. <laughs> you look tired. I feel tired. I've been awake an extortionate amount of time. But it's now time to go home, go to bed, get about an hour of sleep and go back to work. Unfortunately, because Tom's not going to pay himself. I've got to go and get, put a graft on, haven't I? That's how it works. It. It's a cruel world we live in, some it's would say. It's a cruel world we live in. As it but says yeah, on the hoodies. Just please remember to leave a like and subscribe. Follow Tom, follow Zach, follow me. If you follow, follow Zach, he'll follow you back. <laughs> and if you follow him on Instagram, he'll follow you all. Follow and use our code on Forge Motorsport. But that has been us. So yeah, look forward to some more stuff. Obviously, Tom's car. Get your getters in. <laughs> you've still got a chance. You've still got a chance to get it. And we've got three new colours of hoodies coming. So you could be one of the first ones to have one. I will release them when we get some nice pictures taken. But yeah, that's been it. That's been us for today. See you in a bit.